Welcome back YouTube to another video on LSPDFR, the British way GTA 5. Today we're taking it out the custody van for an amazing evening patrol in Los Santos. And we are in this slightly high textured police station. I've got my partner with me, Officer Natasha. Officer Needle Dick is currently on leave. And you might be asking yourselves, why is it always the same equipment, the same uniform, the same card? Do you know why? Because it's the exact same stuff that they're using in real life. But I've got something new to use in the game today. I'm going to show you. First of all, if you're new here, I'll show you the equipment. We've got the X2 taser. I'm going to put it away because we're technically arming it by doing this. We've got the spray. So this is the power spray. Put that away too. We've got the ASP baton. And you know how it goes, guys. You know how it goes at this point with the body cam turned on. I'm going to turn it off and just keep it on buffering. Okay, partner, let's go. So this is going to be an evening patrol. And so we're going to be out at the station. We're going to be patrolling the Mirror Park area today because I kind of prefer patrolling in residential areas. But yeah, we'll also be patrolling in the city area. This is Harvey's updated Ford Transit model, by the way. So if you're wondering what this is, this is a different version of the Ford Transit van that I'm using in this video. This version does not have the problem where you put people on the back and they keep on getting out, which is literally a godsend. It is a really nice model. Shout out to Harvey from the Modix team for this one. Got the lights as well. Everything's all looking very on fleek. So I want to show you the doors as well, just before we head out of the area. So I'll go to the menu. Vehicle, not police radio, sorry. Menu there. Doors. We open them all. There we go. Very nice and proper. So the suspect's actually sitting in the back and there's even room for police officers to sit in the back and keep an eye on the suspect. Well, we can't really keep an eye on the suspect, but yeah, you get the idea. All that nice equipment. Do the, does the, oh, the side door opens as well? That is spectacular. So if we're in an incident, then we can just attend it with the equipment as well. So these vans in London, in the Met, are pretty much incident response that. vehicles as well. You see the patrolling around a lot. Sometimes they use them the same as they do the small estate cars. Oh they're not just like put in the station away if they're not needed. They do patrol. They're like an actual patrol. So if you call in, someone calls the police, sometimes one of these will turn up. But they have the extra capability of being a cage van. So like a lot of things in the Met being a large city police force is the fact that a lot of units do pretty much all the same jobs but they have specialised in some areas so they now have to cherry pick certain calls if they're needed there. But otherwise a lot of them, you know, you get traffic cars doing, you know, responding to an assault. Not one responding to this one because it is way out of our patrol area. Yeah, you get armed response vehicle doing like a traffic stop on someone going past a red light, that type of thing. So, even though they're prioritising certain types of calls, they will be responding to general stuff too. And this, uh, this van is actually much more detailed than the previous version. It's got the Rhino safety step at the bottom as well. If you look carefully in my, the, the uh, vehicle, bottom of the screen, it's a lovely British trafficking game. All these cars are replaced with UK ones, common ones in London too. You've got Vox the Corsa, you've got the Kia Nero, you've got the bus. All sorts. I love it. We're going up this road there, we're going to go to Mirror Park. Actually, come to think of it, I might patrol this industrial district for a bit. And we'll see how it goes with that. This is the best time of the game to play because it's golden hour everything looks amazing the colors pop out the emb looks supreme Sensory 
I knew that was going to happen. Yeah, control shots responding. Alright, we got a vehicle accident behind us. Like I said, we've got a bit of equipment in this van. Might have a road cone or two. We can try and assess the accident or the collision is what we should call it. And call traffic units when we can. Oops. Control, show me on scene. Whoa! Hey, what the hell? Trolley, back up. Yes. Okay, we got a vehicle pursuit. He's just stolen the other Tesla. Tesla. Oh, 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 oh. oh my god, are you good? Yeah, we're gonna need to get a city unit after that. Okay. Right, he's just literally. Did you see that? Because I saw it. I'm trying to think of a way to describe it because it all happened so quickly. Yeah. Control, show me a pursuit. And we got a uh, blue Tesla 3. Uh, one of the Teslas that's uh, rammed the vehicle as well. He's just pulled the other person on the scene, which I believe is a collision with, out of the vehicle. And assaulted him and then <laughs> ran off his vehicle. Alright, our London ambulance is here. Let's go to the side of the vehicle and grab some cones. See that? See? The door? It's just so good. Put some cones here. Create a scene. Hopefully, the paramedic's going to be able to help us. If not, we can charge the suspect potentially with murder. Suspected murder. Because the person is seriously oh my god, he's in critical condition. Guys, we might have to actually call a helicopter. We might need to call this person to get airlifted because this is actually a nightmare scenario. So the paramedics have not got the right equipment. And they're telling me that they let's store the traffic cones, come on. Not the way. There's no option to put the traffic cones away. Oh, there we go. We might have to airlift, and the reason is the ambulance is telling me that there is a uh, traffic jam in the area, and they're not going to be able to take them to hospital in time, so we're going to see if we can get an airlift. We've also got a current incident that's been opened regarding that driver that's made off, but at the moment, trying to be authentic here, we are prioritising the welfare of any people on the scene rather than just punishing the suspect. So let's go put the flare down here. We get London's air ambulance before the sun goes down. We're getting the air ambulance to airlift this guy. We've got so a medical emergency on we're getting the uh, um, road here as well. San Andreas Avenue. All units respond. Code 99 emergency. I'm going to get in a air support in route. Too. Backup needed on um, San Andreas Avenue. It's got a police bike on its way. Dispatch. Perfect sight. Where is the helicopter? Here it is. Here's the bike. Officer, you need to help me with the traffic here, okay? Secure an area, we got the air ambulance around. Where is it? I'm still looking. Maybe it's directly above me. Okay, right, keep the area clear, keep the area clear. There we go, air ambulance is here. Okay, guys, it's over here, it's over here, follow me. Bodies over here. That's what happened. Basically, it was an assault. I believe it's a vehicle condition, uh, vehicle collision. Sorry, we haven't got reports or any more information at the moment. Driver suspects fled off. Obviously, we need you guys to fly them out. So the uh, London ambulance told me basically that that there is a uh, traffic jam. They can't reasonably take them to the area at the moment. There's traffic jam around the corner, one of the major roads. We need you to fly them out the area right away. What okay, it's been taken to the hospital to be airlifted. Shout out to panels for the amazing fire call as mod never gets old. Supreme mod, honestly. It really is. This person's been taken to the hospital. So they put him in the stretcher, they put him in the helicopter, and they're gonna fly off. This is an amazing mod. This is the most I would say the most feature packed implementation of the uh, air and air ambulance I've seen. The only piece helicopter, he doesn't, the second pilot doesn't get into the uh, helicopter. But yeah, look at that, it says alive, see? They managed to save him. 
Now, when we can't get anyone to get revived with the ambulance, that's what we're going to try and do from now on. We've got a suspect still at large. We've also got a crime scene here. Try to get the skid marks gone as well. Okay, this vehicle here, Tesla 3. We do a check on this vehicle. I believe it's a suspect's vehicle. So it's going to give some information regarding that. Vehicle license plate. Megan Blue. Edward Mary one Didn't look like a Megan David yeah, the other vehicle. Let's go Target search it, given the nature of the crime. These cars are so popular, by the way. Tesla 3 in London. If you go to Los Angeles, New York, like, this car is worldwide, man, honestly. It's so popular. Everywhere you go, Tesla 3 or Tesla Y or maybe even Tesla X sometimes. Let's get in the car, let's do a report. Might need to get air support for that suspect, so let's see if we can get in helicopters from above because uh, I don't want to lose them. Helicopter assistance required on uh, San Andreas Avenue. Dispatch, we got a visual on the perp. Okay, so suspect's in the side of town. I need to go drive my van up here. I'm going to put the cones away and we get the vehicle towed. And then we'll look for the suspect. Alright, give me some space, what? guys. Give me some space. With the cones. Let's get the AA to pick this car up. Okay, officers, listen up. We're getting out of this area. We'll search for this car, okay? It's a blue Tesla 3, I believe. Finally, get in the car. Right, so where were they last seen? They were last seen over here. We got one of the local units being alerted to look for them too. Helicopter as well. We need to head to that side of town now before we lose them. So let's see if we get another unit over there because otherwise we'll lose them. Okay. Assistance required to on uh, San Andreas Avenue. It's going to be a response through uh, heavy traffic. Well, maybe not even heavy traffic, but it is still around approximately rush hour time. So we might get held back. We might not though. Currently responding to the last cell location suspect. It looks like we've got an update on the position. Yeah, the, around the uh, Rockford Hills area now. So we'll go ahead there ASAP. Take a right turn down here. Got some moderate traffic, which should be okay. Interesting fact, by the way, in the Met. So you were right, some of you, telling me that vans can't pursue suspects anymore, like the minibus. They actually, the newer versions, they can't pursue them in. The law has changed, but with these station vans, because they're still technically classified as incident response vehicle. Ironically, even though they carry more equipment and they're slightly heavier, they could still unofficially follow and pursue suspects. This guy's just crossing the road. Okay, lights red. Nothing I can do about this. The siren's off, lights off. Put them back on. BMW to piss off. Clear left, clear right. I wrap around this blue car into this dual carriageway. An eye out for where drivers might be coming left and right. I believe they're only coming from the right one way road. Right green is stopping, that's good. And the white car to move to keep in its lane. Want to get that green in front to move out of the way for me. Good, good, good. Ray needs to go in the other lane. Ray, 
for an intersection, visual or suspect vehicle, trying to get through traffic, yeah. That vehicle's in very bad condition, we need to stop them at all costs. Alright, standby, T-Pack, well, T-Pack, sorry, standby for tactical contact. Right, taser deployed. Get out the car. Get the car now. As I can see him. Taser red dotted. I'll make the arrest, officers. Right, you understand at the point in time, you're placed into arrest for assault. And... Grand Theft Auto, stealing the motor vehicle. You know, the same thing, but you may harm a defence, you fail to mention anything. When questioned, some things should later rely on the court. Anything you do say will give them evidence. Let's go search this sucker. Before we put him in the van, we need to search him. Is it clear him of any uh, weapons or anything he's got on him? Partner will do that for me. Okay, you're being uh, taken to the police station, understand? Okay. This is the nice part about the guy's uh, vehicle, by the way. It doesn't have that problem with putting people in the back of it. So, I'm going to turn the siren off in a minute, but we need to get this guy off the road. This is how you make a police van, by the way, guys. This is how you do it. Watch this. See? Easy as fudge. Now, that rear seat in the back, usually you put in the cage area, but the rear seat in the back is for those occasions where the suspect would usually get out of the vehicle or would just stay inside. So, in this case, we would have got a bug with the other police van model, but this one, it's all good. Suspect is in custody. Attention, all units. Suspect in custody. Okay, let's clean up the scene. We got oh my god, we got an issue here as well. Uh Alright mate, you good? Wait! Just get an ambulance for your partner, yeah? Alright, let's get our RV rapid response vehicle. Ambulance. Assistance <clears throat> required on um Boulevard Del Perro. I'm going to use the police tape mod to uh, create a crime like a traffic scene here because it's a bit chaotic and I haven't got time to go to the back of my van and deploy cones. Uh, uh, uh. Alright, keep it back people, keep it back, we've got a situation over here. Okay, we've got London Ambulance here, they're going to try and help this person in the car. Don't die on me. Suspect is locked in my van. Vehicle is in a terrible state. Has it dropped anything inside there? Oh my god, we have to airlift this person as well. Alright, don't worry pal. I'll get an airlift for your friend, okay? See if London Arab has got one more slot. That was depressing. Now, real life London Air Ambulance would not be this available for this patrol. Because it's sundown, it's just before sundown. They're a priority, they're looking for as many jobs they can do as possible before returning to their base. Yeah, that ambulance clearly needs to retake its driver training. Okay, everyone. Whoa! Watch yourself, prick. What are you trying to do? Get out of your vehicle and let me drive it. I'll do a better job than you, okay? There we go. This is how you drive. Well, okay, never mind. <laughs> oh, well, at least they pissed off. Alright, let's get guy. Put them in the recovery position. We need an airlift over here. That's something new. I'm going to create a landing zone here. I'm going to have to pull cord in this area off. We have a medical emergency on uh, Morningwood Boulevard. All units respond. Code 99. We're airborne and moving in. Over. This road is closed. And the other road is closed too because understandably We've already uh, blocked it off with the vehicle control situation. Is there anyone inside that Addison Lee? Okay, that's very odd. I don't know what happened there. Um, what's my character saying?
Here's the helicopter. Just stop right there. We're not going anywhere, okay? It's over here, guys. What the hell? Oh come on, my partner is fine. Why are they taking her to hospital? Bro, that's just weird. I'm gonna pretend that didn't even happen. That just ruined it. I should have just left it. Okay, we pretend that did not happen. That's annoying. Are right, you get back in the van, you idiot? Hey. The thing is, I told the traffic to stop as well. I don't know why they're driving. This Addison Lee right here needs to be taken away ASAP. That is a big hazard. Flatbed. Assistance required on um, Boulevard Del Perro. Show me on scene. Ten four copy. And backup required. Negative. Ten four. Oh my god, really? This is why I need the menu mod in my game sometimes. Because this type of thing happens, this bullshit right here. I have not got the patience to deal with this. The thing is, I actually did a video like this in this game with the menu mod beforehand. And you know what happened? It crashed. Menu is amazing if you want to make short clips and everything, but for like a long ass reliable LSPDFR patrol, you can forget about it. Because you're not going to get anywhere with it. What, did they just leave him like that? Oh, okay. It looks like this person is actually, uh, well, it looks like they're dead. Beyond helping. Leave this area, mate. You're actually pissing People me off. Bye. Right. bye, 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 bye. Sick of you. Go away. All right, we got a potential Bitch. crime scene here now. Anyone else in the car? No. Right. Not cool. Last warning. Leave this area. Boulevard. We need forensic services. Where are they? I think that's the main thing. It's just how some cars are terrible at driving in this game when they're driven by NPCs. I would play roleplay online, but there's just so much drama about. I like, really can't be asked with it. And also, a lot of servers, they their mods are nowhere as cool as the stuff that I have in my game. Some servers are amazing, but then the ones that do have a very cool mod set up generally, they're just a bit too serious, and at that point you might as well just join the real police force. Now obviously this is my own personal experience, I can't speak for everywhere, but people keep on asking me, Oh, when are you going to play RP? 
That's my answer, really, my go-to answer at the moment. Like, I will try some RP stuff soon, but... I, pref I mean, you won't get these cones, you won't get... You'll have palm trees everywhere, you'll have, like, American cars in the traffic. And that just really... I know that they are stupid, but... You know, the immersion isn't broken completely. This is kind of stupid what happened, though. Please don't disappoint me, guys. Come on. Okay, officers, time to piss off. I'm gonna book this scumbag in the police station as well. Here we are. Police station is just on the left. We'll book this suspect in. Oh, red light. Shall we return to station? 10 4, copy. Oh, I'm going to book the suspect in myself, so we're actually going to go through all of the hoops and barriers. There we go. Reverse through here, and we should be at the police station, and there we go. Okay, so... Oops, that's a bit of a bad driving on my side. Right. Vehicle off. Turn it off for the next... Patrol team to uh, get hold of. Well, light's on still, but that's fine. Get out of the car, mate. Okay, now you come with me. <laughs> okay, do you want to follow me? Oh, let's go. Nah, oh, that's the wrong way. Oh, Put it down here for the cells. Where did he go? Look at the idiot. Okay, so what was his name again? Claude Speed. I'm just gonna search him, see if he hasn't taken anything else out. I want to do a police arrest report as well. Fuck this! Enjoy your new home.
that should be enough. Which also creates citation for reckless driving. Oh, hang on, it's not even there. He's crossed several red lights. Yeah, we'll get rid of his license as well. Oh yeah, I'm gonna go just uh check that we vented that in properly. Okay, that's that done. Right, well, we are done today, folks. So I will see you soon in another video, whether it will be in Los Angeles, London, or somewhere else. Till then, stay tuned.